Today, we're starting off with Koshy's Budget Challenge. Every week, with the help of the team at Compare the Market, we show real families how to find better deals on their biggest bills and save potentially thousands of dollars. Let's meet Emma and Narayan. Adelaide couple Emma and Narayan have just welcomed their third child under four. It's an exciting time for their growing family, but childcare fees and living expenses don't come cheap. Let's see what we can do to help. Emma and Narayan, how tough is it at the moment with three little kids as well <laughs> and a newborn? How are you yeah. juggling it? It's pretty we're, tough. Yeah, it's it's tough. It's, um, yeah, the life work balance with the kids as well, trying to get them entertained as much as we can. It's uh, It's been a struggle, but we're, we're battling through it. Yep. What are you finding um, your biggest financial pain points at the moment? Honestly, all, all our outgoings. <laughs> um, yeah, our, our groceries, our, our bills um, a lot. Um, energy. energy. It's almost across the board, isn't it? You're, you're getting hit from everywhere. Yeah, it just feels like maybe we were putting a bit more money away previously and now, um, now everything's just gone up, all our bills. There's no wins anywhere. So what have you had to cut back on? Entertainment, we don't really go out, so we don't really do much, but that might be the newborn life as well. Yep. And we have our children in childcare, but often we have to call on parents who can have them on a day instead, so we can just save some money there. Because I've got to say, even with rebates, childcare is enormous, isn't it? I yep. did the sums for my kids and worked out that childcare on a daily basis, you pay more than private school fees for year 12 kids. My yeah. goodness. It's outrageous. Yeah, I, I didn't realise that until I started looking at some of the numbers as well, I, how yeah. much it actually was costing. What about your financial goals? What have you, you set yourself? Short term, probably another holiday. <laughs> Haven't had one in a while, but with or without the kids would be nice. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but long term, um, probably looking a bit more into schooling for kids as well. And maybe future, future, a bigger house for each kid to have their own room. Let me tell you, I reckon a lot of people can relate to your situation. Everyone's going through it at the moment. Hey, the team at Compare the Market has gone through your bills. Let's see if we can find a few dollars to add to that holiday savings account. Where's your dream holiday? Ooh. Where can, can we send you? Uh, I don't know, I'd like to go to Japan, but you'd like to go to Italy. <laughs> oh, whoa, OK, all right. Let's see what we can do. Come and have a look. Great. Welcome back to your money and your life. Let's return to Emma and Narayan, our Adelaide couple with a gorgeous new bub. We've gone through their bills with the experts at Compare the Market and found some big bill relief. All right, Emma and Narayan, let's see what we can save in terms of some of your big bills and put it towards that holiday. Yeah. We've looked at all of your bills. Big area for you is health insurance, of course, with the size of your family, three kids, but Emma, the band is complete. The band is complete. Okay, <laughs> all right. Um, knowing that, and remember all of these are just thought starters for you to have a look in. You're currently on a gold health insurance policy, which of course includes maternity and obstetrics and things like that. So if you don't need maternity and obstetrics for gold anymore, it may be worth having a look at, say, a Silver Plus plan because that covers you for 30 hospital treatment categories and extras including dental and optical as well and could reduce your premium by as much as 2000 bit over $2,000 a year. Big difference. That's huge. Yeah. Yep. That and we've also looked at Bronze Plus policies as well. A little lower level of cover but still includes hospital cover and for some dental surgeries as well as ear, nose and throat services. And those options are starting at just under $4,000 a year premium. So that would be reduce your premium by almost $3,000. Yep. Yeah, that's a lot. Whoa. <laughs> Wasn't really expecting such a big jump. But understand if you do decide to go again, <laughs> and number, number four, you're, you're thinking about and you want to go back to gold, you'll have to reset the waiting periods. Yep. So I think have we're a safe. Think about that. <laughs> Emma, that's a very determined I'm very safe. Yeah. I'll be getting the snip before that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, <laughs> let me check whether the snip's included. <laughs> I'll need to get back to you on the on the snip. 
Moving on to car insurance. Pretty good car insurance on your Mazda, so well done on that. But there may be another way to stash some more cash in your savings with a couple of tweaks. The team at Compare the Market crunched the numbers, and if you can afford to increase your excess to $900, that would save $200 off your premium per year. Okay. And finally, your phones, your phone plan at the moment. You're paying off a couple of phones at the moment. When you do that, we found a phone plan that essentially doubles the amount of data on your monthly plan for $17 less per month. Right. But if you were looking for the identical data allowance of your current plan, you could save even more. Switching to another provider could save you about $27 a month. That's $324 a year. Okay, great. Mm. Which is big. Definitely. And for two phone plans that you currently manage, the saving is around $650 a year. Right. So when we've looked at it all up, with these tweaks, depending on the changes you're willing to make to your existing policies and plans, you might be able to reduce your household bills by more than $3,000. Wow. Yeah. Great. It's a big <laughs> saving, it isn't it? Is. Yeah. yeah. That helps with holiday, helps with childcare fees. Yeah. And because you've been so lovely to deal with us and for having us in, in your home, compare the market as a little surprise for you as well. They're going to add $1,000 in cash. <gasps> what? Towards that travel account as well. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> Thank All you right. so much. Thank so, you. That, that gets you, I think, at, at least a couple of airline tickets to somewhere romantic to Japan for both of you. So <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. So enjoy and thank you for having us. Thank uh, you. It has, it has definitely uh, opened the eyes on a few things and we're looking into it for sure. Thank you.